All right, gentlemen, we're going to go ahead and talk about this particular topic. Uh, by the way, welcome to my channel. This is the J Professor channel, men's self-improvement channel. If you're new to the channel, please don't forget to hit the like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Gentlemen, we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to go ahead and talk about the whole child support situation. And I truly believe it's out of control. And for me personally, that kind of gave me a little wake up call. Like I looked at that picture that I'm about to show you guys and I was just so blown away by this whole child support system and how um, men are treating this stuff, right? And even certain active, I know some active fathers that I personally know that are involved with child support, that they have child support. And it's totally an unjust and unfair that the burdens on the fathers in most cases. And that's why I always tell you, gentlemen, you must be cautious of who you get it in with, cautious of the kind of women you bring into your world because you gotta understand this, gentlemen. When women are emotional creatures, so when things don't go the way they want, they become extremely vindictive. They are extremely vindictive. And I want you all to be extremely cautious with the kind of women that you bring in. Like, having a child is a huge blessing, right? I'm not taking that, not taking nothing away because we're all born from somebody. But at the same time, you gotta be cautious of who you carry with. You gotta be cautious of who you um, injects, you, 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 you bust a nut in. Like you have to be cautious with that gentleman because a lot of times we're so in the moment it feels great you know the comment was all it feels great and then when you release it feels 10 times better i know i made that bonehead mistake a couple times before right and these are my younger days when i was extremely reckless where i had no type of you know i wasn't horrible but i had some reckless moments you know didn't think things through didn't think long term and that's most cases for people in their 20s but now in my 30s, I'm extremely cautious with the kind of women I'm bringing to my world. I'm extremely cautious of how I deal with them. And I'm still, I'm not perfect. I'm still making mistakes. But at the same time, I'm extremely self-aware of myself. And I'm extremely self-aware of situational awareness. Like, I'm extremely aware of her emotions, her state of mind, the kind of relationship that we have. Like, I'm extremely aware of those things. And that's what every man must have, is they must have situational awareness. Now... When it comes to these situations, gentlemen, it just is pretty much some of y'all fault. You know what I mean? Um, like I said, when you are reckless and you release, you're more likely to get her pregnant. And when you get her pregnant, the last thing you want to do, I mean, dude, it's this is why I always preach, man, dick discipline. Because of these type of situations. These type of situations are going to hold you back. And that's why... I'm trying to tell y'all fellas, you need to be cautious. You need to be cautious with who you put a baby in. I don't care how cool y'all are. I don't care how much of a good woman she is. When you do her dirty, she will be vindictive. She's gonna try to come after you in some sort of fashion. And child support seems to be the one that is very common. I mean, gentlemen, look at this picture. Look at the child support bill especially for those who are average earners you're done you're screwed not even just average earners people who make a significant amount of income like it hurts it hurts your pockets you know what i'm saying and at the same time and and, and my opinion this is my opinion i believe that child support is truly meant for Child support is truly meant for fathers that are not active or fathers that are not around. That's in my opinion. But for some reason, it's really coming for the guys who are actually involved in child's lives. You know what I'm saying? And it holds a lot of brothers back. And I know deep down, a lot of brothers are going through it. They're like, man, why did I get this? Why did I get this chick pregnant? What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Because the stuff was so good. I understand the stuff is good. But at the same time, we got to be extremely cautious and extremely careful. Make sure, gentlemen, I'm going to be real. 
If I were you, I would be so, I would sign, have a girl sign, sign an NDA. I would be so cautious to the point where, because I just don't play that, man. I don't play that. I do not play that stuff, man. Because I understand the ramifications that come behind all that. Because I've seen it, I witnessed it. I witnessed it, and it hurts. It kills your pockets. It clogs up your purpose. Not saying that it's not gonna happen. I'm not saying that dreams are impossible. When you do have a child out of wedlock or a child that you, or with a woman that you're not with, or you guys don't have any cohesion with, but it's gonna hold you up. And this is why I always recommend you fellas, before you get into a serious committed relationship, before you get in any type of relationship, you gotta have your bag ready and you gotta have some experience. You gotta have some maturity. You gotta have some self-control. Some of you guys are having babies in your 20s and then you're suffering consequences. Like I said, I'm not saying a child is not a blessing. A child is a complete blessing. However, you gotta be cautious who you have a child with. Some dudes get lucky. Some dudes get lucky where, you know, their baby mama happens to be cooperative. You know, she comes from a good background, but a lot of times, you know, a lot of these women that y'all deal with come from screwed up situations. And that's why the importance of vetting, understanding who she is, where she comes from, what kind of friends she hangs out with. Those are things that you have to take in consideration. But a lot of you dudes are so reckless and don't realize these things. This is why you got to have some some situational awareness. Understanding what you're getting yourself into. That's what's going to save all the headaches. Gentlemen, I have friends that are dealing with this stuff. And they're stressed out. They may not talk about it. But you can feel their spirit that is stressing them out. They can't do certain things because they got to deal with taking care of the child. Not even just taking care of the child, but the child support is going to hold them up. I'm telling you, be cautious of who you put a baby in. I don't care what it is. Be cautious. If you don't see a long-term benefit behind this particular woman that you're getting yourself into, you're getting yourself involved with, don't bust in her. Be careful. I'm telling you, gentlemen. I'm warning you. Be careful. I know. I know it feels great. I know the feeling is awesome. I know you're like, yeah, I'm, I'm giving it to her. But at the same time, you gotta be cautious. Think about the consequences. Weigh out the pros and cons before choosing to deal with a particular woman. Even if you're just getting in and having a good time. You gotta be cautious, you gotta feel the vibe. If your spirit, if her spirit doesn't align with yours, leave her. Don't deal with it. That's your discernment speaking to you. Even if you're having a good time. But I want y'all fellas to truly be cautious of who you get yourself involved with. I'm telling you, man, I've seen it too many times. I don't have to go through it to learn. I'm learning from other people. So please, gentlemen, be cautious of who you have a baby with. Remember, men and women are two different creatures. Yeah, there are men that are vindictive, but women are more likely to be vindictive and petty revenge i'm telling you they're emotional creatures so when things don't go the way they want they become extremely extremely vindictive so gentlemen please be cautious of who you get it in with be cautious of who you get yourself involved with and i promise you life is going to be great gentlemen if you find any value in this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel don't forget to hit the notification bell and also, gentlemen, if you're going through any hard times where you feel stuck, you feel unmotivated, hit the link in my bio, book a session with me, and I promise you, I'm going to make sure I get you to the next level. I have multiple strategies and ways to help you become a superior man. Peace from Jay, the Professor.